Hi everyone. A little while ago, someone asked me to do an explainer on the different types of join states for Azure AD devices or, or for devices in Azure AD and the management states. So I thought it was a good time just to go through that now with you. I've set up four devices. The first one, as you can see, is CMC-1. And this is an Azure AD joined device. This device has never been on my domain. It's connected to the same network, but it's not it's not joined to Active Directory domain services. For what it's worth, this computer also doesn't have an MDM, so I haven't enrolled it into Intune, but otherwise it's an Azure AD joined device. So you would log into this computer by typing your UPN. The next one is CMC-DJ01, and that's a hybrid Azure AD joined computer. So what we know about this computer is that it's joined to on-premise ADDS and then it's synchronized to Azure through Azure AD Connect. Now let's take a look at what that means. So we'll log into this computer. As you can see from a user perspective, we just type our password. It's nice and simple. And we go to uh, command prompt. And let's type um, dsreg cmd slash status and that'll give us a, a quick overview of the various things but mainly the join state um so at the top here you can see it says azure ad joined and then domain joined so this is hybrid and that's you know that's that's how we, we confirm that it's definitely hybrid there's a ton of information in here that i will go through in another video certainly not relevant for this video here but let's let's keep it to that um, and the other thing we saw in uh, the Intune console that I just showed you, this one here, was that it, it's, it's not MDM enrolled. So this actual computer that I'm referring to now is, uh, is config manager managed. It's managed by a cloud management gateway. So it's, it doesn't have any enrollment into Intune. If we look at CMC-DJ02, you can see we've got a bit more information about that one. It's hybrid Azure AD join, so exactly the same join state as the previous one that I just showed you. But the MDM is specified as config manager. Let's take a look at what that means on the computer itself. So we'll just log into this computer and uh, skip past all of that. You can see this computer is, um, is co-managed. So you can see its co-management capabilities are 239. That's not 239 capabilities, it's, it's a, it's a a number uh, it's, of course it's a number it's a, it's a number that directly specifies exactly which um, management capabilities are available it, it's a, a sum of the values in the table here which means we can individually reference exactly which values are enabled based on adding up finally back to this uh, in tune portal you can see we've got dj03 which is uh hybrid is your ad joined so it's exactly the same join state from an ad perspective as the other devices that we've just seen but its mdm is in tune let's take a look at that one let's quickly log into this one and we'll see what we've got here so uh, as we know it's uh in tune managed we'll just jump into control panel not control panel, into accounts. Click access work or school. And what you should see just in the corp, uh, in the domain join section here, we've got info now, which appears alongside disconnect. And then you can see the things that are managed by the MDM. That means it's MDM joined, in this case, managed by Intune. So that's really all I had to say, really. It, there are only two types of join state. Well, there's three if you count on-premise and not not hybrid. So there's, there's on-premise, there's hybrid, and there's cloud only. And then within that, there's two types of management state. There's co-managed. Ah, there's three. So there's the config manager only. There's co-managed. And then there's um, Intune only. So that's it really. It's a bit complex, but really you need to pick the right management platform for what you're doing and you can mix it, right? So you can have cloud only devices, 
such as kiosks or, or devices that leave, leave the office and never come back uh, as, as cloud-only devices. And then you can have co-managed devices being laptops and that kind of thing. Hopefully this has been helpful. Apologies, it took a long time to get to this stage. But thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Thank <laughs> you.